It's been almost 15 years since someone shot and killed a Georgia teacher visiting Portsmouth. In October 2009, officers found Arthur Smith Jr. shot to death inside his car. And to this day, no arrests have been made, and his family is still searching for answers. What happened to him and why? Who, what did he help do to anybody? For somebody to do him like they did. Mary Smith says 15 years later, she still wonders every day why someone would hurt her son. But she says she will continue to remember him as an amazing and respected English teacher. He loved working and teaching and helping other people. He was not one to stay and just do what he wants. His younger brother, Dexter, remembers Arthur helping and teaching others growing up in their neighborhood. Oh, he reached a lot of people. Smith's family says he drove to Hampton Roads October 2nd, 2009 to watch his eight-year-old son play football. They say he did it most weekends to spend time with his two kids, and they thought everything was fine until they got a call saying Arthur was dead. We have no witnesses that have been able to come, that have been, uh, that were an eyewitness to the incident. Portsmouth, Virginia detective Gino Jackson says police received a call reporting gunshots near Arthur's car. Jackson says it's a cold case, but they'll revisit it if they get new information. It just hurt to hear something like that. Arthur Smith Sr. worries he may never find out what happened to his son, but now his family is asking for more. It's been years since we ain't heard anything. Brother Dexter agrees. When it happened, we really never got a whole lot of answers. Other than that, we know he was murdered, found in his vehicle with the windows rolled up. Investigator Gino Jackson says he's sorry for the family loss, and they are still doing everything in their power to find out who killed Smith. Hey, if you know anything that could help Portsmouth Police solve this case, call the crime line at one 888 lock you up Remember, you can remain anonymous.